We manufacture digger parts, spares, attachments, etc. We sell all over the world. The, these parts were stacked on um, small cantilever racks, uh, which had to be obviously manual, manually uh, picked off. The actual logistics problems we was having is our space. Um, we was vastly running out of space uh, and to get the space we required we needed some another mezzanine floor which was going to cost a lot more money than a vertical lift machine hence having the vertical lift machine. This area was full of all parts uh, now we've emptied this they go in the second machine which uh, filled the machine about three quarters full. Right, we bought this first machine, the Vertical Lift 1, three years ago and it was that good as this was the internal tray machine. Then the bosses decided to buy the second machine which was an external tray as we've got heavier parts in the second machine where we needed the external tray so we can get a crane uh, to lift, uh, or a hoist I should say, to lift the heavier parts out. The parts we stock are pins, bushes, bucket links, tipping links, all for different machines, all types of machines. The parts were stocked on racking, uh, different size racking, different heights, lengths, all over the factory uh, in different areas. Now with the vertical lift machine, they're all in one, one place, so we know where everything is. The light bar we do use, um, uh, it's very advantageous to us to be perfectly truthful. As when we used to stock the parts on the racks, they was all in numerical order so we could find them. But we don't even have to guess where they are now or try and think where they are because the light bar comes on and tells, it, tells us where it is. We organise the trays, we get the, the quantity that we stock with the weight and then we calculate what the tray can take. The three main benefits of the machine is um, obviously space, um, everything's in one place and the third one, um, they're easy to use, there's, there's, it's very very simple. <laughs>